win loss record. Uh, the wins that I have and the losses, the losses were basically due to the fact that I was playing in Akuma and that Akuma was like a nightmare. So, yeah, that's probably the reason why. And the Akumas are like, seriously, they're, they're, they're difficult to play. Oops, my ergonomic mouse just knocked it over. I don't know why it was there in the first place. I'm going to start off this guy with some pokes because I really like to basically... Oh, I actually had back press. I don't really know how do I get clipped by that. Yeah, I seriously don't know how I got clipped by that. Like, I absolutely did not know how I got clipped by that. But, <laughs> yeah, this is Tekken. Very fun playing Tekken when I when I know what the plus frames are. Oh backlash sometimes works. Oh no, I missed it. He just mashed, basically. Oh, that... That's such a good frame Jin has for, the, for that God Fist. Oh... I really dislike the counter hit that Jin has. I really dislike it. It's not. It's, it's not really something I enjoy doing. <laughs> that was a down, down two, a down forward two. It turned into. Oh no! I shouldn't have gone gone for that. I actually enjoyed that match. That was a good one. <laughs> not sure whether I'm gonna get a revenge match or not. <laughs> that was a good match. This is going to be my demo. I'm probably thinking about just playing one more and then I'm going to move to some other player. I'm going to do a power crush at the start. Mm -hmm. What a range. Good range, good range. That counter hit, he's, I mean, he's getting really lucky, honestly. How was, oh, I think he blocked that, because it was on plus nine, how did he...
Oh, how did he hit the can can? That was weird. Uh, how did he hit the can can? I I, <laughs> I had back press. That was weird. Uh, I actually clicked the wrong button. Oh, come on. Seriously, you thought about using that attack? Anyway. Side step. Sky rocket. I think I should do the running, running. Oh, that mu idiot! This and uh, this guy, I I should really alt F four against him. Really, that th this was this was such a bad thing that these people used exploit. Power crush. Like this is such such a like a bad thing. I'm not gonna. Get, I mean, even if I. Yeah. So here you go for using the rage out, you little idiot. Like there's not even a clear like counter for that. So, uh, what you can do is if if you if you uh, if you're like going in to Jin to double Jin to basically you know just uh, like uh, challenge him, he can do that flip. And even if you've got a good move, there is a chance that it's going to miss, which is like it's horrible, absolutely horrible. But this is going to be my last uh, last match right now. It's really bad. Like when when you've got uh, you know things that that are like that, it's it's pretty stupid. <laughs> Brian player. So let me let me show you what Brian players do. Uh, they have got nothing from neutral. Like the thing about Brian players is that they have got nothing, absolutely no 50-50s from neutral. So they can't really do anything. And like Brian players. They're not that easy to beat. I'm not going to say that they're pretty easy. I think that was probably a minus. Like, um, that's the thing about brand players. Back to. Oh no, Snake Edge, how did I not <laughs> see that coming? Oh, his frame was faster than mine. Oh, again, Snake Edge. Nice one. And good one. I was like, speaking it a little too lightly. Enjoying this one. I'm gonna just... Oh no. Again, Snake Edge. Ah, getting caught by that so many times. If I get caught by such snake edges, then I deserve to lose, really. He's got nine wins, too. Like, he's, he's on a roll. I'm gonna try to counter hit this guy. Yeah, got it. I'm gonna skyrocket him. Come on, come on. Yeah. <laughs> Final round. Fight. 
Yep. Oh no, how did it get scalped at the stick? I'm so far, it's so far away. No, oh, I think I'm gonna lose this one. Oh yeah, I'm gonna lose this one. Yeah, good one. Good match. Took him a little too lightly, but um, the fact about Brian players is that they're, they're just so predictable. Like, some of the things are too pre so predictable. Their snake, ed snake edges are like, they take like years for it to just, uh, you know, be uh, to execute. And uh, sometimes what happens is, is that they have to hide it. And sometimes, um, there, some, some of them are very good at hiding it. And what happens is, is if you are like, um, kind of, your brain is programmed to do the one, two, or this punish, uh, they actually duck it. Don't really do anything. I'm gonna, I'm actually going to play a little bit different in this match one. In this one, I'm going to pressure him. I'm just going to pressure him whether I win or lose. I'm gonna pressure him in this match. I just want to pressure him. I don't really want to do anything else but pressure him. Oh wow! I didn't know what that move was. That's, the that's probably the first time I've seen it. Next time he's gonna get launched. He's ducking. I'm basically going to be uh, going to what I'm going to do is I'm going to <clears throat> this is a terrible player though Oh no, <laughs> that's cool. I really want to play this guy. I mean, I really find this guy to be an absolute jerk. So I really want to just give him a loss if he actually accepts the match or stuff. Probably I'll do that. All right. Oh my God, what, what the hell is that? Okay, so I'm gonna start off with the with Leo because Leo players I think this guy doesn't know how to play how wrong oh nice I'll sweep So it's kind of like, um, I think I'm going to start with the power crush and see what happens, yep. Ooh, nice. Oh, nice, man. Oh, what a... Yeah. <laughs> that, was, uh, that was a weird one. Like, why did he go for low? He could have gone for mid.
Should I play against this guy again? Like, uh, make make this like a practice match for Leo. Or let's do that, just play, let's play another match. Because I don't really know how to play Leo. The only experience that I have playing Leo... Well, I've, I've watched somebody play Leo, but I don't really know how to play Leo. <sighs> I suppose you do not know how to play Akuma. What I'm going to do is I'm going to focus on fundamentals, okay? So, right now I'm just going to kind of like focus on the fundamentals. Oh. Oh, nice hop kick. Oh, nice one. Oh wow, there was a parry? That's cool. Power crush. Another power crush. Should have blocked the low. Round four. Fight. <laughs> You're gonna get perfected. Oh, this guy's trying very hard to win. Oh! Nice. Yeah, actually, I should have just ended the power crush. Oh, the guy was lucky. Ah, not sure whether he'll play at me again. Oh, he's got a heart. By the way, I'm just going light on him, so don't think that I'm, and I'm in the mood to go light. Let me just get me into the into the focus of actually going very hard. I actually don't want to, but uh, yeah. I'm gonna. I'm. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to use the power crush from now, like. <laughs> Yeah. Power crush! <laughs> Power crush! Power crush! Power crush! Side step, skyrocket. Oh, skyrocket missed. Damn it. I think I actually got got the middle one. Ooh, nice one. Side step. Oh, no, no, no. Side step. How is that not punishable? How is that not punished? Like, how was that not punished? That was weird. Nice. Oh! Mm hmm. Round four. Fight. <laughs> 
Foi crush. Power Crush Power Crush Oh, nice one Nice one Power Crush I'm gonna jump over him. <laughs> I really like annoying player people like that with how wrong. It's it's actually well listen. Leo is okay since the size is small, but the developers have given him such an evasive move and the mix-up where it is actually a guess. Now you'll say, okay, fine, there are many things like Haorong you have to guess too, but Haorong is also like a player that has extremely difficult time actually getting into the, you know, getting into that place where they, where he can actually start, um, start damaging. It's not like uh, everything is available to him. You actually have to work to, oh my God. <sighs> Don't really want to play this player. Okay, fine. This is definitely the last one. Hopefully, I'll win. If I lose, I'm still. This is still going to be the last one. I'm, I mean, I I simply do not have enough energy or uh, you know any, any motivation to play players like this. <sighs> the gin match was. I really enjoyed that. So let's see what this guy will do today. Power crush. I wish the Sky Rocket was evasive, man. Okay, so this is going to be a fang. It's also Glomcon. An extremely, like, uh, you can say, a player that just, like, continuously attacks, 
has no fundamentals and Harong is susceptible to pressure. So I think I'll have to focus on punishment and I've also have to focus on his mix up. What he does is he basically uses a lot of Kempo and he basically waits for the other player. So uh, what I'm going to do is this is since this is going to be my last, I think I'm going to basically be playing it as if it's my last. So, so we'll take a look at him. He's going to wait for me. Like, he is a player that doesn't really approach. You can see that he's not approaching, right? He is a player that doesn't approach. He basically just stays there and doesn't, of course, he doesn't show his, yeah, he's got balls. I'm gonna counter hit this guy. Wait a second. <sighs> Fish. <laughs> oh gosh. Come on, duck, duck, duck. <laughs> See, as soon as you don't give in to his strategy, Oh, come on, just have to beat the backlash, man. I'm gonna throw you. Come on, come here. Come. No, fish. It's cheap, player. <laughs> I think I'm not gonna win this one because I was a little cocky, but he's gonna go. Yeah, I knew it. Take him, take him. A ratful. Take him, so we don't care. This was my last match, anyway. So. You can see how annoying this player was. Like he was, he was waiting for me to attack, not not really engaging in any kind of, uh, you know, a fight. Very dumb. <laughs>